Estoy feliz porque... Lo maté. Lo maté loco. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. No has caído. No has caído. What's good, friends and family? Mr. Flip Flop here with you on March 20th, uh, the year of our Lord, 2020. So, just to give you guys a heads up, all the info spreading around. As you guys know, uh, Dominican Republic, well, with all the, all the stuff going on in the world, a lot of people are interested, interested and curious about what's going on in DR. First of all, you guys be safe. Um, you know, with, I see the whole world is pretty much shutting down. I won't give my opinion on that. I've told people how I feel about that. You know, I think uh, things have gotten completely out of hand. And now they're uh, creating martial law in the States. So you guys be safe. Be careful. Protect yourself. Um, stock up on your food. Social, those who are practicing social distance, that's definitely a help to stay away from the virus. Okay, but um, also, so, uh, the President and Congress and the uh, Chamber of Deputies, um passed the state of emergency here in Dominican Republic. It was from, uh, a travel ban was installed from yesterday, the uh, 19th, up until April 3rd. So now yesterday, the Chamber of Deputies added 10 more days onto the original 15 days of the state of emergency. Now, what does this mean? So far, from everybody I've spoken to and from the news, the travel ban is still on for the first 15 days, meaning at this moment right now, and as we know, things could change, at this moment right now, Dominican Republic is banning all travel from every country into Dominican Republic up until April 3rd. The extra 10 days was added for more, more social distancing, meaning clubs will still not be open, uh, events will still not be happening, 10 days extra after the 15 days. Will they lift the travel ban? They have yet to decide. They're going to wait and see what's happening in the world in the next 15 days to decide if they'll lift the travel ban or leave the travel ban an extra 10 days. At the moment, people are still able to fly in on April 3rd, April 4th at this very moment. But that could change. So the state of emergency was extended for the country uh, for an extra 10 days, uh, basically, you know, April 13th. Basically saying we're going to keep everything closed as far as clubs and keep people from gathering together in big groups. Which, in my opinion, I have a lot of opinions. Doesn't make sense because if you know Dominicans, they're posted up in the Camado right now, 30 deep. And I, last night, right outside down a block from me, they were partying at the Camado. So, so much for social distancing. Uh, but the clubs and stuff and big gatherings will be closed. Uh... Basically, only, only uh, businesses that are necessary are going to be open. As I told you guys before, Flip Flop is open only for takeout and delivery. So we'll be doing that. I'm going to actually see how that goes for the next five days. If I'm, I'm, We're not making money, but it's just to keep people fed. And, you know, I know people, we have some tourists that are still in town, some expats that don't cook for themselves and need food. So I'm doing the takeout and delivery to make sure everybody's still good. Uh, most of my staff is home, but we're running from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. We'll take out on delivery. So we'll see how that goes. If it's cool, I'll keep it going. If not, I'll shut it down and wait till this is over. Um, a lot of businesses will be affected, as we all are affected around the world. A lot of employees will be affected. Um, speaking to a couple of people that I know, uh, higher, you know, Dominicans higher up, they are actually worried about rioting right now in the next week or so. Because last minute, shut the, shut the country down. People lose jobs. People have no money. You know, the, the, things are going to get scarce soon. You know, uh, it I hate to say it, but someone made this comment to me, and things will get worse before they get better. And that goes for everywhere in the world, but here, here more so because there is no stimulus package in Dominican Republic. You know, I'm, I'm myself in concern because I'm like, wow, you know, we, things just started getting better. I made it through last year with all the mystery deaths and, and the loss in tourism through that, and now things just started getting back to normal. And then we have the coronavirus. So uh, a, lot of, a lot of people will be affected as you guys are affected back at home. Uh, but more so here because there's no stimulus packages. There's no, nobody helping, you know. So basically that's what it is. So just to reiterate my point, state of emergency is passed in Dominican Republic. 
All travel is banned for 15 days up until April 3rd. As of now, as I said, that could change. They, uh, the Chamber of Deputies added an extra 10 days to the state of emergency to keep all bars, clubs closed for more social distancing and big gatherings. Okay, so those are the facts. I bring it to you like I bring it to you. Hopefully, you guys be safe back at home. Keep the hand sanitizer on deck. If you feel, if you do feel sick, go to the hospital. And I will say this: uh, they did say there are something like 34 cases in DR right now. The biggest problem that Dominican Republic is having, and and this is, this is not my commentary. This is from uh, the news. There may be more cases. Obviously, there may be more cases. Um, but the first five cases were tourists. And there was tourists from France, tourists from Italy. Two, I don't want to say idiots, from America that got on the plane knowingly sick and came down here and tried to quarantine themselves in the Dominican Republic. Now, I don't blame you. Dominican Republic is a great place to be quarantined. I will give you my quarantine update on Sunday service. But why would you get on the plane and you're sick? You, who knows how many more people you infected? That's, that's how these viruses are spreading. People are sick and not thinking about other people. You know, I myself have sent everybody away from me like, hey, you know, not, not, not for me, for them. You know, I, I don't feel sick, but, you know, I don't want anybody to get sick if I happen to be sick, you know. So I keep my distance from a lot of people. So be safe, guys. Uh, that's the information right here. Right now, flights are banned until April 3rd. That could change. We should, we should see. But state of emergency until April 13th. So you guys be safe. Love you. S support the channel, Patreon, Cash App, PayPal. Uh, Sunday service, stay tuned for that. I will give you an update on my quarantine status. <laughs> uh, even though I got to be outside. But my quarantine status. And let you guys know what's going on with me. Appreciate all the love. Mr. Flip Flop, I'm out.